Welcome to tutorial point. In this video, we will solve this problem. A particle has velocity u is equal to u1, u2, and u3 in S frame, and u prime is equal to u1 prime, u2 prime, u3 prime in S prime frame. From velocity transformation formula, prove c square minus u square is equal to c square c square minus u prime square c square minus v square over c square plus u1 prime v, v whole square we know u square is equal to u1 square plus u2 square plus u3 square and u1 is equal to u1 prime plus v over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square and u2 is equal to u2 prime beta 1 plus u1 prime v over c square u3 is equal to u3 prime over beta 1 plus u1 prime v over c square so so c square minus u square is equal to c square minus u1 square minus u2 square minus u3 square now put value of u1, u2 and u3 in equation 1. So this becomes c square minus u1 prime plus v over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square minus u2 prime over beta. 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square minus u3 prime over beta 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square and beta is equal to 1 over square root 1 minus v square over c square and 1 over beta square is equal to 1 minus v square over c square now we open square which is equal to c square minus u1 prime square plus v square plus 2 u1 prime v over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square minus u2 prime square and 1 over beta square is equal to 1 minus v square over c square over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square minus u 3 prime square and 1 over beta square is equal to 1 minus v square over c square over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square now we will we'll take lcm which is equal to 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square so this becomes c square 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square minus u1 prime square plus v square plus 2 u1 prime v minus u2 prime square 1 minus v square over c square minus u3 prime square 1 minus v square over c square 
now again we will open the square of this term and multiply them so this become c square 1 plus u1 prime square v square over c4 plus 2 u1 prime v over c square minus u1 prime square minus v square minus 2 u1 prime v minus we will multiply u2 prime square inside so this become minus u2 prime square plus u2 prime square v square over c square minus u3 prime square plus u3 prime square v square over c square over 1 plus u1 prime v over c square whole square so we multiply c square inside so this becomes c square plus u1 prime square v square over c square plus 2 u1 prime v minus u1 prime square minus v square minus 2 u1 prime v minus u2 prime square minus u3 prime square plus u2 prime square v square over c square plus u3 prime square v square over c square over you can write this as c square plus u1 prime v over c square whole square so this term and this term cancel out and from this this and this term we take common minus sign and from this term and from this term and this term we take common v square over c square so this become So this become c square minus u1 prime square plus u2 prime square plus u3 prime square plus v square over c square u1 prime square plus u2 prime square plus u3 prime square minus v square over c square plus u1 prime v over c square whole square and this term is equal to u square and this term u prime square and this term is also u prime square so this become c square minus u prime square plus v square over c square u prime square minus v square over c square plus u1 prime v over c square whole square this can also written as c4 c square minus u prime square plus v square over c square u prime square minus v square over c square plus u1 prime v whole square and we take c square inside so this becomes c square c4 minus c square u prime square plus v square u prime square minus c square v square over c square plus u1 prime v whole square so we take c square 
common from these two terms and v square from these two terms so this becomes c square c square c square minus u prime square minus v square c square minus u prime square over c square plus u1 prime v whole square so this become c square c square minus v square c square minus u prime square over c square plus u1 prime v whole square which is equal to c square minus u square hence proof